My friend, first of all, I thank you for your prayers for positive Christianity during our recent disaster of losing our entire mailing list of email addresses from the past 15 years. We're back. We're restored. We're better than we were before, thanks to God. And I'll be telling the whole story beginning next week. You want to listen for that, and it will also be on Positive Daily Inspiration. It's quite a story. We're constantly making choices in life. Life is about choices. We're constantly making decisions. And some of those choices, some of those decisions that we've made in the past have not been so good. And we needed to make better decisions. Instead of having regret and thinking, oh my, uh, as we look back, we need to decide to learn from those decisions and go to God next time and listen for divine direction. That's the key, listening. And it's not with the outer ear, it's with the inner ear of the mind and the heart. In Proverbs 3, verse 5, it says, Trust in the Lord with all your heart. Do not rely on your own insight. When you trust in God with everything inside of you, your very essence, well, everything begins to change. You develop the habit of listening for God's direction. And you won't be governed by changing times, what's in the news, uh, personal wills and wants. Divine direction is higher. And divine direction will lead you to your highest good and true lasting satisfaction. And often, you don't know and I don't know what will give us that lasting good satisfaction that we so desire. Well, God does. And when we hold in mind the truth of God's unqualified love for us, we find that not only do we have constant access to divine ideas, but it only takes an instant to access it by becoming still and listening in love for divine direction in all that we do. And in so doing, we will live our lives on a daily basis with increased confidence. We will have confidence in more than just our own abilities. We'll have confidence in God coming through our own abilities, and that changes everything. Calmly and with the assurance that right answers are at hand, we're going to be able to make decisions that determine the course that our lives will take. And we will cultivate a loving mind and heart as we think about God's never-ending love for us. Listening to God's direction, it always provides rich, wonderful rewards. I pray with you today, my friend, that you are able to listen to God's direction. I pray that you do not rely just on your own insight, that you first go to God and you listen. You take time in patience to do this so that it becomes full in your understanding. And then at that point, you proceed and you'll be even surprised yourself how good it all works out, better than you could have conceived of in human mind. 